Okay, uh, DTG fans, it is t-shirt time. Uh, and I won't lie, it's, uh, it's, I'm finding it a little bit difficult to put the t-shirt on this platter thing. So uh, I think I've set the head height right, although it was scuffing the paper a little bit. I think there's only one way to find out that, and that's probably ruin a shirt. So I've got this picture and I think everything's set up. So there we go, let's hit print and probably get pissed off with it because it makes a mess of it. So I'm uh, waiting. Doing something. Been having a little difficulty with it. With the paper just not working properly as soon as you try. First impressions. Mm -hmm. I'll say that when I stop holding my breath and see what it does. First impressions, perhaps a touch light, but yeah, let's just see what it does. I think I got somewhat lucky with that area uh, with the sort of dragon's nose on it there that's right up against the edge that but you look on the picture and it's uh, it's within the boundary I'm gonna have to figure that one out I? You just have to bear in mind that any design you're going to have to sh shrink it out. I'll have to do some sort of measurements with it. You know, where I'm not printing off a full picture, I'll just print off like uh, just little blocks on the, on the edge and that way I'll know exactly how much room I have or haven't got. Aye, well, let's, let's just not count our chickens just yet with it. But. I managed to get the uh, colour issue that it was having sorted the other day down to uh, print fab just being a bit unsuitable it's probably the kindest thing to say about it the first test I did with print fab and all and it's just like jerking it about and bashing and making a right racket and you can just see now it's doing it much more carefully the mode I've got it in here is like actually double the resolution of the picture but I knew that wouldn't matter and I wanted it to lay down a bit more ink I'm just hoping now that the uh, my camera doesn't run out of memory in fact just because that's a possibility I'm just going to stop it here and then you know pick it up when it's done it basically see you in a bit Okay, well, it's getting towards the end there. Um, just 
worried about it. I don't. I almost don't want to say it. I don't. I'm not going to say it. But let's see. Well, look, it's going. It looks like it's going to go off the edge there a little bit. I think that look of it. Right. Yeah, I'm going to have to stop it there because it's going off the edge. Right. Well, that's something else to note, isn't it? Think is the print head off the edge? Yeah. It's scuffing it and making a mess at the bottom there, isn't it? I have to just bear that in mind in the future, right? I'm just gonna hit cancel there because it's gone off the bottom. Yeah, maybe that this end see that? Oh that shit. It's annoying. Right, so yeah, my camera run out of bloody memory. Uh, so, uh, in conclusion, yeah, it's all right, but it's not centered. And perhaps the bed is not perfectly level at the end there. And in future, I might just have to keep the image within, you know, a good centimetre of the edge to avoid that sort of thing happening. Because uh, it's like, you can see it smudged the head on the, on the bottom of it there. Perhaps it, it's raised up just a touch where it's uh, on the edge. Anyway, I want to keep this brief, so because it'll run out of memory again. Uh, all in all, pretty chuffed with it. I'm just going to let it dry on the bed and then, like, take it off, press it tomorrow when it's dry. Um, I will have to measure the platter and do some tests, test prints to it, because you can see there at the top it says 100, 200 millimetres and so on, down to about 400 down the side. I've got it set at... I think that's a that's either A3 or A3 plus, and it's obviously it's it's not centered and it's gone off the edge and I don't want to mess around like that. I just want to get the image, bang it on there, print it on t-shirt, and then get it off to somebody else. A little bit of lint on the side there. So yes, all in all, eighty percent success there, and uh, yeah, why the colours? So yeah. Not really that much more to say, I just have to keep doing it. Like I say, I'll press this, wear it, wash it, see how it works, uh, and crack on. So, yeah, man. Peace out. You can see the detail in there. Seems to have worked relatively well. So, yeah, jobs are good in a bit.